Hey, this is Sharif with ADSR Sounds, and today on this quick tutorial, I'm going to show how to utilize basically using one machine uh, group kit, basically with a pattern, and utilizing that to create uh, a good foundation for a production idea and or a full production. Um, utilizing one kit, one pattern, and Prism effects by Native Instruments and Molecular by Native Instruments. And using those effects to create some melodic material um, from the drum patterns and um, combining those and creating um, a nice production. So um, first off, I went to my, you know, kits, chose this beam kit and i um, going to create a pattern really quick. And so we're going to use the hardware to do most of this stuff. And uh, here it goes. Checking my sounds. Okay, so. Okay, so now I got my first little drum pattern right here. Nothing, nothing major, nothing crazy. But um, now I'm going to take this duplicate and put it in another group. Holding down a duplicate and choosing plus events because I want the MIDI events, the pattern, to also uh, get duplicated to the new group. So choose group A. It's blinking, showing that it's in the clipboard. Choosing group B, and now I have the additional or the exact copy of the sounds and the actual pattern. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mute A because I want to go and choose a different set of, uh, you know, different sounds for this particular kit now um, to play the same pattern but different sounds. So let's check it out. I kind of like that. Cool. So I have that there. So... What I'm going to do is duplicate B, right? Put it in group C. And now in group C, maybe change these sounds and um, choose, choose a different category of kits because I had it on urban. Let's try maybe something analog. Okay, so now let's, uh, I don't know, random, and I'm just going to load. Let's hear it. And I'm going to solo. C, so we can just hear what C's got. Turn the volume down on this. Let's try something. Yeah, why not? Like that. So... Not necessarily worried about the sounds that I'm going to use on this. What I am going to do now is add the prism effects. So we all got prism effects um, that came with your purchase of machines. So everyone has this particular effect. So on the uh, group level, make sure you're on the group level. And I want to go to the empty, the next empty slot. So I don't want to erase my maximizer. So on the controller, I'm just going to tab over to empty slot right there. And go to effects and go to the prism and prism uh actually is an effects or and a actually is a, a synth that uh lives in the 
reactor environment. So they have the synth, it's a, a modal synth and it has effects. So you can use the effects on your sounds as well. So on the group level, I'm gonna check out some of the effects on here. So let's, let's check them out. So I'm gonna load and let's hear it. Let's hear what the one of the drum kits. So now that's Prism that's playing that a dark Christmas preset. So this is like really nice um, uh, ambient dark melodic sound playing, which is all created from the drums, my drum pattern. So now I'm going to do and duplicate A and put A on D. So hold now duplicate, get A, put it on D. Now I have D happening there, and I'm going to choose now the molecular plugin. Now molecular comes. Uh, when with your purchase of complete ultimate native instruments complete ultimate or you can buy it separately if you don't have you know the ultimate you can buy it separately and you know it's an awesome plugin actually a little, it's a little secret on it it's, it's awesome especially for anything you want to run through it so I'm going to go to browse and I'm going to choose I'm going to use the hardware this time and choose molecular and molecular is right there and now we're going to load this on the group so make sure that I'm not that you're not gonna uh, overwrite any group effects that you already have on the kit. All right, so I'm gonna tab over and I'm gonna choose empty, browse, and let's check them out. So load this, and we're gonna go through a few of these. And I'm actually gonna solo D, because I just wanna hear D right now. And uh, let's check some of this out. <laughs> See how that sounds with C.
pretty cool. So utilizing one uh, drum kit with uh, some basic pattern and you can go in here and start, you know, deleting patterns, make another, you know, deleting events, should I say, MIDI events in, you know, making different patterns and have it play different melodic passages. You'd be surprised just with drum patterns, these MIDI events that you create, something really simple can start creating something real melodic strictly just from the drum, drum pads, utilizing uh, the molecular and the um, prism effects. Okay, so let's hear that back and we out. Peace.